Hello everyone, this is Epic IQ and in this video, we are sending you to a jungle, to get some wooden logs. Cutting trees is really bad but sometimes you have to do it for a living. So, you are a woodcutter and you have been asked to stack the wood logs. Now all these logs are of the same size. You start stacking these logs by laying down 20 of them at first. Side by side, on the ground. Obviously, this stack is going to be dangerously high, but can you find out the total number of the wood logs that will be used in this stack? The first row has 20 wooden logs, and you make a stack till the top row has just one. Like a triangle. How many logs would be in this stack? At Epic IQ, we stress on a visual approach to solving a problem. Can you think of some visual scheme? To find the solution? Can you see a pattern? Try solving this problem and in the meanwhile, if you love visual math, or solve math problems for fun, you can support us by subscribing to this channel. The answer to this problem will be the 20th triangular number, which is 210. As you have already seen, this is like an equilateral triangle. A triangular number or triangle number. Count objects. Arranged in an equilateral triangle. So, the first triangle number is, obviously 1. The second triangle number is, 3. The third triangle has 3 points on every side, and the total number of points is, 6. So, the third triangle number is, 6. The fourth triangle number is, 10. Now, it's time to get clever. For our ease, we shift these points to make a right angle triangle. Now, the nth triangular number will have n points at the base and n points in the height. You would notice that it now looks like a half square. We get creative again and create a duplicate of this arrangement of points. We rotate it and shift it to make a rectangular array of points. It looks like a square of size n, but you would notice that the base now has n plus 1 points. So the number of points in this rectangle will be n into n plus 1. Since this n into n plus 1 rectangle has twice the number of points than the triangular number, the nth triangular number will be n into n plus 1 divided by 2. Many of you would recognize this n into n plus 1 by 2, as, the sum of first and positive integers. So, we find out that, the number of objects in a stack, with side n, will be the same as, the sum of first and positive numbers, which is, n into n plus 1, by 2. Also, if we have 20 wood logs at the bottom, the total number of logs in this stack will be, 20 into 21, by 2, which is 210, or the 20th triangular number. Hope you enjoyed this visual approach to solving math problems. A visual understanding can make even a complex problem look easy. Don't forget to subscribe if you like this math video and want us to make more such videos. Thank you for your time and have a good day. Thanks for watching.